Brendan Gulick and Josh Rendiro from George Finney Stadium in a banner day for Baldwin Wallace University football. The Yellow Jackets with a tremendous showing, especially on the offensive side of the ball, and they blow out Marietta. Final score today, 52 to 24. A game in which at one point they actually scored 31 unanswered points when they were down 10 to 7. So it was a struggle early on, but once that offense got going, man, Jake Hudson had him moving up the field quickly. And it was going downhill. And, and for me personally, this offense that struggled early in the season absolutely came out and played spectacular today. Hudson, I think probably safe to say our player of the game. He was responsible for more than 360 yards of offense, both with his arm and with his feet. But he had a lot of help, weapons all around him making big plays. And they got the, the ball into their playmakers' hands. And as well, that offensive line really stepped up today. It's not a very showy position, but without that offensive line, we don't have those many points on the board today. You're right. With the last couple of weeks, the offensive line struggled today. They were so much better. Some numbers to throw your way, and you can certainly see these on the screen along with us. Some team stats. BW, 73 plays for 572 yards of offense. But what impressed me was when their backs were against the wall, 8 of 13 on third downs, they were able to move the ball effectively. Marietta did have over 400 yards of offense, but they couldn't sustain drives, just 3 of 12 on third downs. And a lot of turnovers, too, for this Marietta team. They had a lot of mistiming, a lot of miscommunication, especially between fields and those receivers. But, I mean, outside of that, very consistent showing in that first half. It's just a second half to forget. Chad Steinwalks really did a nice job today, one of the best games of his career. He caught five passes and three of them in the end zone. Hudson threw five touchdown passes in total, 260 yards through the air. Tyquan McRae, two more rushing touchdowns. He carried it ten times. And in a day where just about everybody had a chance to touch the football, McRae shone pretty well. Absolutely. Jordan Leverett as well, Ty Gallo, getting the ball in the hands of your playmakers. It sounds simple, but BW really capitalized on it today. The Yellow Jackets flat out needed this win today. They played very well. They got it. It took a little bit of time at the beginning of the game to get in a rhythm, but at the end of the day, they figured it out, and now they are back to uh, not only their winning ways, but they, they've got this mojo back, and it's good to see with the Wilmington Quakers coming to town next week, BW has a chance to put together a second consecutive big offensive day. Again, a big win for BW. They throw up more than 50 points today in beating Marietta 52-24. to For Josh Rendiro, I'm Brendan Gulick. We'll see you next weekend for the Yellow Jackets and the Quakers.